We're coming out of hyperspace. Everyone up front. There's the fleet. I hope you're right about this. Ah, look on the bright side. They open fire and we'll be breaking the galactic record for going from zero to space dust. Battle stations? Warm up the turrets. Keep the targeting computers on standby. Charging to full. Blizz, shields. Leah Starling and Bulldog. Hail the flagship. You know this is probably a trap. Even if they don't shoot us down, handing us over to the Republic would probably help deflect the flak they've been getting. I'm aware of the predicament, Mako. Just let me be worried. Somebody's gotta be. Hailing. They're transmitting a flight path. We're to dock in Hangar 8. They aren't shooting at us. So far, so good. Well, we're committed now. My presence was requested. I've been ordered to bring you before my lord, Darth Tormund. Submit to search and seizure and come quietly. You trying to take me prisoner, Lieutenant? If you attempt to resist, yes. Alien filth has no right to question Imperial protocol. You will not be allowed before a Lord of the Sith armed. You will comply, willingly or by force. I'm not going to be at your mercy. Seize them. You won't get away with this. Ooh. Quite a pile we stacked up. So, do we make a run for it? I came here to speak with the Sith. That's what I'm going to do. I don't have a better suggestion. Let's do it. Mako, lock out access to this hangar, and be ready for further instructions. No sweat. We're all counting on you. I see you've disposed of your escort. You the one who sent that summons? You are here because I have use for you. Do not forget that. Today, Corellia's leadership swore allegiance to the Sith Empire. Despite total occupation, the people openly rebel. What should have been a bloodless victory has escalated into full-scale war. The Treaty of Coruscant is no more. I want the Supreme Chancellor's head in my hand when I deliver victory to the Dark Council. You will provide it. Don't ask much, do you? I ask what I require. If wealth and acclaim are not enough incentive, perhaps revenge will motivate you. You have made an enemy in the Supreme Chancellor's closest advisor. Do what I ask and you will have your opportunity for vengeance. The sooner I get to break that Jedi's face, the better. So long as our enemies remain on Coruscant, they are beyond even your reach. But Jun Seras will not be difficult to draw out. Getting to him will put you within striking distance of the Supreme Chancellor. Corellia is where we will put them down. There are obstacles that must be removed before we can act. You will remove them. Person, place, or thing? Some old enemies from the last war have re-emerged. A Republic privateer made famous assisting Hilo Vs break the Mandalorian's blockade. And a Kuwati noblewoman credited with orchestrating numerous successful uprisings on Imperial-occupied worlds. You want them back or gone? They could prove useful, but leave nothing to chance if there's any risk of their escape. This star chart shows the last destination of your first target. Make it his final. My subordinates will brief you upon arrival. Mako, the situation's taken care of. Unlock the hangar. I'll explain when I get back. Really? Th that's it? Okay, see you soon. Mako, run this data. All right, just one sec. Okay, I've updated our astrogation computer. This is a pretty obscure system. Thanks, Blizz. I think I've got it. Last I'd heard, Belsavis wasn't even worth colonizing. The Imperials have it designated as a Republic prison world, though. I like a sense of mystery and excitement. That's something I like about you. 
even if your taste is a little questionable. Got a good crew. They get the job done. Haven't been part of a company since Ariadu. Missed it, I guess. Commander Fett's men didn't seem too bad. Decent. Wasn't there long, though. Gotta have someone watching your six. Wonder what Clan Ordo's doing now. That friend I said you reminded me of? Got a hollow call from him. Turns out Coridan heard about us taking down G-Cone on Terrace. Sent me an invitation. He didn't draw a line in the sand, I hope. Over Jikon? No. He'd have done the same as us. Said he's hunting big game. Offered to let me in on it. Plan to take him up on that. Wanted to let you know. Won't be long. Not going to introduce me to this friend of yours? Don't like competition. Cory Dan had spent the trip trying to impress with you along. I want you to meet him. Got catching up to do first. Catch you later. How was it? Amazing. Met Coridan and half my unit on Duxon. Good hunting. Bomas and Maurers mostly. Jagger bag to Zakeg. Lucky Jare. Did my big hunter skin as a fireside rug? Tried. Maurers aren't known for their hide. Just their mange. Got a few more stories to tell. Can't ask for much else. Back to hunting prey on two legs. Right. Some people don't appreciate my work. When they get in my way, they get hurt. I'm a bounty hunter. I track down individuals nobody else can find. That's one way of looking at it. I chop the nago. Bedwana ubi kila watabanki dongo podokanoda. Tanta zuza chaska pakuta kis katada wata. Mo kila mo grunki yat ambumba boshida. I find people for a living, Blizz. You'll see them again. Asta wa oto agwa dupi. Yes, I guess you throw their ciphers a party with clowns and a juggling bantha. Stupid data pad is impossible to decrypt, but not all is lost. Found a holo address for Coral, I think. I mean, it could be her. I sort of wanted you around when I called her. I've got your back, Mako. Call her. What's the worst that can happen, right? It's not her, or it is her, and she instantly hates me. Not a problem. Right, it's nothing to worry about. It's just a stupid call. Hello? Hi. C Coral? I it's Coral, right? I, I Mako. Mother of... M Mako? My little sister Mako? I I can't believe it. I thought I thought you were dead. How did you find me? Wasn't exactly easy. I uh ran into an SIS guy looking for you. Isaac? The SIS agent? Was his name Isaac? Name was Cartery. Oh no. Uh Mako, you've gotta help me, please. If you're gonna tell me SIS is after you, I already figured that out. Cartery's just one of the agents after me. Isaac's the one leading them. If he finds me... What? What's he want you for? I've gotta go. I I've been on this channel too long already. He's on drum and cause looking for me right now. If there's anything you can do to stop him. Wait, Coral, what's going on? Why is he after you? They're already trying to trace my location. I, I have to go, please. You're the only hope I've got. What is it with people never answering my questions? You finally talked to your sister. What's your take on her? 
She's really like me, isn't she? I really have a sister. Let's go to Drum and Koss. Hold it right there, Coral. For the love of... I'm not Coral! Don't do anything stupid. We should wait for Isaac. Are you crazy? What are we supposed to do? Ask her to just behave herself? I'm just saying Isaac will be here soon. Let's not jump the gun. Uh, hello? Guys, can we talk for a minute? Maybe Isaac will get here soon, or maybe he'll decide to stop for lunch first. We don't exactly have a lot of options here. Don't think there's a point in talking to them, Mako. Someone is gonna answer me this time. Hey, girls! Over here! Look out! She's attacking! Sorry, did you say something? I'm sort of half here. I'm not feeling so good. I keep seeing those dead girls. My sisters. I just feel... Queasy. Anyway, sorry, um, did you need something? I'm here if you need me. Thanks. Can you cure a massive case of being freaked out? I don't exactly know how to get over seeing myself. Two of me die. And you know the worst part? Coral didn't tell me, didn't say a word about other sisters. Coral has some explaining to do. No kidding. I'm getting answers out of somebody if it kills me. Or them. Uh, preferably them. Let's get moving before I get even more weirded out. What is it they say about curiosity again? Does it involve lavish paid vacations? <sighs> Maybe trend of Shawnee flat cakes? So, I may have gone back into the SIS computers. Just a little. You wouldn't be telling me this if you didn't see something in there. Am I that obvious? Oh, gotta work on that. Remember how I said I found birth certificates from my family? A dozen of them? Well, I found out that ten of them also have death certificates. I know you got your hopes up. Wish it had turned out better. I'll get over it. Not like I haven't got tons of orphan experience already. I guess it's just me and Coral now. Well, on that cheery note, let's move on, huh? Notice anything different? Are you going to get upset if I say no? <laughs> Hardly. I'll just chuck it up to fine craftsmanship. Just acquired some nice form-fitting blast armor. Thought I'd see if it would stand up to a trained eye. Apparently so, if your observation is any indication. Glad that worked out for you. Since I'm still putting myself in harm's way, I decided to make a little investment in my well-being. Been stocking up on interesting tidbits at every port we've hit. From here on, I'm ready for anything. Lieutenant Hall, Imperial Intelligence. I have orders to act as your liaison. I have prepared a briefing, should you require it. Start from the beginning. I haven't been given a lot of details. This is Zael Barrows. After helping break the Mandalorian blockade during the war, the Republic offered him considerable latitude to plague the Empire. Oh, him a bloody lip. Then, after the Treaty of Coruscant, the Republic retained him as their unofficial ferryman to Belsavis. You have a location for Barrows' ship? We observed his freighter land on Belsavis before our forces invaded. No vessels larger than a shuttle have been spotted leaving the surface. Bell Savis is a remote ice ball with minimal natural resources, the perfect place to keep things you'd rather forget. Which is why the Republic has constructed a substantial prison fortress here to hide away their undesirables. I'm not looking to lay siege. What are our options? Our landers can insert you into the Republic fortifications relatively near the last known location of Barrows's vessel. Get me on the ground, Lieutenant. It will be absolute pandemonium, planet side. This is my direct hollow frequency. I am on call, should you need me. Won't be dull. Ever eaten Mandalorian food? At your adoption, maybe? Is that your way of asking me out? Maybe. 
Thought I might make you some tingular. See what you think. Pick a time, and we'll have dinner. Good. Plan on it later. Think of it as a challenge. They say any woman who can survive a plate of tingular is a keeper. I'll fix you some soon as I can get back to the galley. What is it, Mako? I just touched down. I've been combing through the Imperials' network since we docked. After cross-referencing their records with data on the Holonet, I hit Pater. Surprise, surprise. There are a lot of people locked up on Belsavis with outstanding bounties. That was good thinking. Just doing my job. Most aren't worth much, so I narrowed it down to the best payout. A gang of bandits who heisted a major shipment from the Exchange. This one's all or nothing, so here's the complete list. Oh, and don't worry about dragging them back. These creeps are wanted dead. Sounds like lover boys coming back. Ain't you gonna welcome him home? Convict! Take him! Hey, Zale! I like your plaything! Maybe I'll keep her a while! You ain't Zale! Tell me where he's hiding, or I'm gonna crush Curly here like a bug! I'd like to know the same thing. Who's the woman? Zale's little girlfriend. Wanna kill her. But she's the only one left who can ride him out! You can just shoot me. I'm not telling you anything. Cooperate, and I'll get you out of this alive. I'm not stupid. I'm dead. Sale, why did you have to play the hero? I wanted to leave when the first siren sounded. Zale insisted we stay to help evacuate if things got too bad. Too bad. Understatement of the year. Looks like that didn't go to plan. The central power plant failed, and the hangar doors are closed. Even our ship can't put out enough juice to open them. <sighs> We're trapped. Zale stormed off after some argument with a warden, said he had unfinished business. He took M30B to get the central power plant back online, said not to wait for him. That's all I know. I can work with that. Find yourself a better hiding spot. I... I can go? You ain't going nowhere, girly. And your boy's gonna hear all about how you died before I kill him. I said she can leave. And I said she ain't walking out of here. You wouldn't stand a chance against me. Lucky I ain't got time to peel you out of that can. Run. Early, but when I find you, I'm gonna see how much you can scream before your lungs go. There'll be trouble. Cut it a little close there, Em. <laughs> Nice trap, you. <laughs> I kinda hope the first time I met you would it be captaining your one-way trip to lockup. Things rarely go the way we want them to. That's deep. But you moonlight as a Jedi Master when you're not blowing up orphanages? Someone's coming. Of yours. Hate to disappoint, but even your thick skull won't break through this force field. What are you standing around for? Let's blast this place to pieces! I don't throw temper tantrums. It ain't a temper tantrum! Blast the generators and Zale ain't got nowhere left to hide! Soon as this field drops, <laughs> me and Zale are gonna get reacquainted. If he's dead when I get back, I'm gonna be real upset. Don't you worry. I plan on keeping him alive a good long time. Dirty rock! What happened to Barrows? A 
rat scurried down this little hole while you were taking a sweet time wrecking the place! Tin Can wouldn't give up where he was going. Guess I broke it. You just became a problem for me, Hauk. You've got three seconds to come up with a solution. I got an idea how to keep this heap talking. There's lots more junk like this thing, walking around, keeping the runts in line. They get built at a plant deeper in. Bet there's parts to hotwire this trash and shock some answers out of it. Show me this droid plant. Place is inside Max Lockup. Ain't getting in there without some major boom booms. I only got this dinky piece. You blast the place up. I'll haul this junk over and grab us a couple of tech heads on the way. Deal? Let's get down to it. Come on, come on. Got you right where we want you now. Thought I smelled something burning. Found us a couple of volunteers. <laughs> you can't be serious. You want us to try and fix this? There's hardly anything here worth salvaging. I only need to get inside its head. Find me something telling me where this man is going. I, I, I think we can handle that. Dean, grab a diagnostic pad and a hollow emitter. This might take a little while. want those prisoners, they'll have to crack them out of the tomb. It's out of our hands now. You can evacuate, Warden, but I spent too many years putting those fiends away to let it all be for nothing. Come on, Em. We're heading to the tomb. Give us an idea where he's headed. If the little punk's trying to keep the imps from getting in the tomb, he's only got one way to go. all the way out of Max to miss my shot at that twerp! Leave them alone. I think I know someone who can help. <laughs> my target's last known destination is something the locals are calling the tomb. What can you tell me? Unfortunately, everything we know about the tomb comes from the Republic's limited records. It appears that most of the interaction the Republic had was with the tomb's custodial droids, and only samples were normally allowed to enter. Would presenting myself to the custodians be an option? The droids retreated inside the tomb when Operations Group 1 and 2 forced their way through. All contact has been lost. Commander Grang is in charge of gaining re-entry to the tomb. He'll be able to give you the current situation. However you'll get through, if you can reach these coordinates, contact me. I'll bring you up to speed on any discoveries. I'm coming along. I ain't been waiting this long for someone else to have the pleasure of killing Zale. You get me that twerp, I show you where the law hides all the contraband on this rock. Deal? I'll do it against my better judgment. A friend takes a hike too, in case you're thinking you can pull something. Don't trust him. I don't plan to. Keep your calm open. Cross her, you'll regret it. We're just getting warmed up. Horn, I'm in position. What have you got for me? Analysis of data from the custodians is coming slowly, but I believe we found a solid lead. The bulk of the samples taken recently appear to have been interred in a vault we are designating Block 44. 
The majority of the Imperial prisoners have likely been taken there, making it the probable destination for your target. If Barrows came to stop the Imperial rescue op, shouldn't he be after the highest profile targets? It's possible, but with the majority of our forces concentrating on liberating the Dreadmasters, it's unlikely he'd go unnoticed. It's your call. These are Block 44's coordinates if you decide to pursue it as a lead. If Barrows is sighted elsewhere, you'll be the first to know. Horn out. Nobody shoot, truce! Look, we could settle our differences, but not right here. I have to stop the Empire. Stop them from what? From freeing these prisoners, these monsters. Maybe you never saw the footage, but I was there when they sacked Coruscant. You know how many civilians died from the bombings alone? You helped us spoil their rescue, permanently. And I'll go quietly. I try not to bite the hand that feeds me. Can't blame a guy for trying. Fan out! You're mine now, front! I was so close. So close! I would know who you are and how it is you came to our rescue. Darth Tormund hired me to deal with Captain Zale Barrows. Him. Your master has my thanks. He will hear of your contribution to our cause. I am Lord Andreos Thos. We are what remains of Operations Group One. Have our forces been able to free the Dread Masters? There were some complications with the Eshka, but it's been handled. Good. I will continue my attempts to free these prisoners. Carry on with your business, but stay out of my way. Been thinking about this since you dumped me on this rock, Sailor boy? Got it all worked out how you're gonna go. Aren't you gonna do something? You came here for me. What about your bounty? I'm delivering Barrows in the condition he's in. We had a deal! I'm not helping you torture anyone. Fine! Lucky I still need you. Thanks. I don't want to know what he had in store for me. I wouldn't want it to be me. You've been rubbing me the wrong way since I met you, but I'll let that slide if you do me a favor. I figured joining up with you is my best shot of getting off of this rock. What you say? I'll kill for you. Bad chance, Psycho. I'm done butting heads with you. You're wrong there. I'm leaving on your ship. With or without you. Get me? If it gets me out of here, fine. Smart. Real smart. Just get this little twerp out of my sight before I decide to crush him. You have surpassed all expectations, Hunter. The Dreadmasters are safe. In freeing them, you have truly accomplished the Emperor's vision. I'm worth every credit. And the Dread Masters were an expensive contract. I agree completely. Compensation has already been arranged. It goes without saying that all events on Belsavis are strictly confidential, especially those pertaining to the Eshkar. But enough formalities. With the Dread Masters freed, the galaxy will know fear once more. The Emperor thanks you for everything. You're here to take Barrows off my hands? I noted your return. I figured it was safe to assume you were successful, given your reputation. 
I've prepared a report of your success for Darth Tormund. I have your compensation right here. It's been a pleasure working with you, Lieutenant. Likewise. I admit that I assumed your reputation exaggerated. I see I was mistaken. I must return to my duties. Again, a pleasure. Everybody front and center. You didn't mention we had a guest. Who's our large friend? Torian's usually punctual. Oh, let the kid have a day off. Better yet, wrap this up so I can get back to mine. He told me he got a message from an old associate. They were going to meet at the cantina. Out here? He tell you anything about this old associate? Not really. You know Torian. You think this wasn't a friendly meeting? He won't answer. Or can't answer. I don't like either. Should we head to the cantina? You're starting to bore me. Who do you think you are? I'm Skadge. Skadge? Okay, interesting. Call me Mako. This thing begging for a treat? Skadge, don't you worry. I've got it committed to memory. So what's next? Tormund still has a target for us to deal with. You've been a busy girl. Too busy. You should spend more time with your loved ones before they're gone. I'm extending you an invitation. An opportunity to appreciate what you have before you lose it. But if your little boyfriend is in marriage material, we understand. There'll be plenty of other opportunities for us to meet. If you want a chance to say goodbye, come to Hoth. We won't wait long. Torian, we've got to save him. They so much as scuff his boots and they're dead. If anyone can get him back safe, it's you. Ah, or at least humiliate them to death. So what are we gonna do? Set a course for Hoff. Right, let's do this. I was starting to think we'd have to finish without you. Cut the garbage. I want an explanation. I can give you that much, but I don't like raising my voice. Keep walking. Ambush, run! You aren't saying anything your friend doesn't already know. You know, Grand Champion, you've got talent. The Overseers would have scouted you eventually. We could have helped you make a real mark on the galaxy. Now you'll have to settle for your gaudy title and the price on your head. Let him go, before you do something you can't take back. You should really take your own advice. Bounty hunting isn't a game, whatever the Mandalorians think. It's serious business, with serious consequences. Consequences you're about to become intimately familiar with. That's my girl. I owe you, again. My turn to be bait, I guess. Well, I always did find you attractive. Lucky me. Oh, this should have been total overkill. How many more of you are out there hunting me? I don't know, I swear. Nobody does. We work independently. This is the first time I've heard of overseers acting in tandem. I want out. I don't care how good the money is. It's not worth it. Begging the wrong person. Your call. Dues paid. Finished? Grab your gear and get a move on. Blizz, meet us back at the ship. You must stand on. Never thanked you. Not making a big deal over me taking off. Good to see my brothers are still alive. Cordan owes me 50 credits. 
He owes me a lot more. I was lonely with you gone. Think I can spot him that one. Been meaning to ask something. Mandalore tell you the race will nare when you were adopted into his clan? There was a lot of stuff in Mandalorian. Could have been talking about the weather for all I know. Sort of what I thought. Racial Nare means six actions. The core of Mandalorian life. Speaking the language is a big one. I could teach you, if you're up for it. Private lessons from you? I can think of worse ways to spend my time. Could learn all kinds of things. Have to find some time later, then. Got a few minutes? Maybe you could give me a few pointers on my pistol technique. Doesn't hurt to get some practice in. Won't take long, I promise. Because actually, I just wanted to show off. I've, I've got a new shot and I can't wait for you to see it. In fact, I'm sort of looking forward to seeing it in action myself. So what do you think? You're getting pretty good. Thanks. Let's move. I kind of want to shoot something now. Glad to see you both made it back okay. Be back on the hunt? I think it's safe to proceed. One of Tormund's lackeys forwarded a star chart to a system called Voss. The place isn't even on most maps yet. There's a lot of scuttlebutt about Voss's discovery on the Holonet, but it's pretty far-fetched stuff even for spacer superstition. The astrogation computer's updated and ready to go when you are. Okay, I'm not looking. Promise. I appreciate the gesture. I could help out. Just try not to get your hopes up, all right? So, what do you know about Hilo Viz? I've heard the name. She was some big-time spacer, wasn't she? Ah, you could put it that way, if you're partial to understatement. She broke the Mandalorian blockade at the Hidian Way. You know, the one that strangled Coruscant and dashed a full-scale Jedi assault. And it wasn't out of the goodness of her heart, either. Credits were involved. A lot of them. I like her already. Oh, she was quite the lady. You could say that run was the height of her career, but that's only because she dropped off the scanners not long after. Most think the Huts were behind Hilo's disappearance, but anyone who knew her could tell you they'd have better odds winning a marathon. No, she's still out there. Somewhere. Never took you for the type to get starstruck. What now? We've got history. Hilo was my old partner. More than that. That blockade run was the last thing we ever did together. Like I said, a lot of credits were involved. When I saw the opportunity, I took off and left Hilo holding the bag. Stupid. You double-crossed your own girlfriend? Technically, she wasn't my girlfriend when I double-crossed her. I was young and naive and maybe a little afraid of commitment. I didn't know what I lost until it was gone. Listen, I found out that an old associate from that blockade run is still around and kicking. A mutual acquaintance. I owe Hilo one last visit. If he knows where she's been laying low all this time, I've got to track him down. Been working on a new shot. Something I picked up watching you. Want to check it out? I'm having trouble thinking of anything better than watching you shoot. Good. Showing off for you is pretty much the point. Let's get to work. The sooner we're moving, the sooner you can see me in action. 